Hello, my friends. We actually beat a Bundesliga team. To be fair, it's the team that just got promoted from the Zweite Bundesliga, but we still beat them, okay? So St. Pauli, 2-1, get in. We had a penalty, and then Joe Gelhart scored in the 55th minute. We conceded a little bit later on, but it was all right. We were in control. We also drew with Stuttgart, which is kind of unbelievable considering they're in sixth place. They're, you know, they're only eight points ahead of us, but, like, you know, get in. Let's go play Olympiacos, and maybe we'll start. Maybe. I was planning on this being rotation game against Olympiacos because I got a got a comment said you got to you got to put the accent on the O at the end, not the first O. Olympiacos. Hopefully that's right. Uh, but we've also picked up some knocks and some niggles. So uh, Patrick is out with a pulled calf muscle. Uh, Bosdegan is out with a gashed upper leg. Karim is out with a pulled groin. Evan Rotundo is still out with pulled knee ligaments, my friends. He's been out nine days. It comes back in a week and a half. So it kind of worked out anyway. So Luca Pudlek is going to go in between the sticks. Um, Joe Scally. Sorry, my mom is texting me. So Luca Pudlek in between the sticks. Joe Scally, Steve Cook, Eric Lanford. Yes, Eric Lanford. One and a half star Eric Lanford. He looks like a baby because we don't have his photo yet. Um, yeah, about that. Nikolai Bolison, Nassim, Zavi Simons, Mehmet Chan Aydin, Marvin at the 10, Siri Sane, get in at the left wing, and Marcin Toporkiviks. 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 Something like that. Marson is going to start up top. He's up to two and a half stars. The lads had one sub in the league, in the cup, and in uh, under 21 uh, Euros qualifying. And he's continued to improve. I think it could be quite good. You think? So, yes, I understand that is a pretty heavy rotation in that, like, winning is worth 630 grand. But we've already secured qualifying right to the next round right so and we do have the league to worry about so while it is quite the heavy rotation it gives an opportunity for these lads it's like this is why you get a squad Th this team has given up 14 goals in the group stage thus far so can we get something done with oh he just run right past you Nikolai he's just run right past you mate <laughs> like Nikolai's like one of the more senior players, right? Like that wasn't uh Lanfer that got beat there, right? Like that ball went right over his head. I mean, maybe it was Lanfer here that didn't cover the run. No, that's not his fault. No, it's the it's Joe Scally. That's Joe Scally, who again is one of the not more senior players, but it's not like he's a one star, you know? Um So maybe this is a terrible idea. Um, but I kind of think it makes sense to, to give this to give our guys a rest see if we can oh, what a marson second goal of the season nips the ball back does a little one of these does a little best dad ever a liverpool t-shirt that my wife got me a couple years ago get in honey um zavi look at that plays it forward says no no i'm going to score I guess he, did he win the ball back or he just intercepted the pass? It doesn't matter. The 17-year-old has scored to equalize in the Europa League, my friends. I think I've got a favorite coming. <laughs> Don't know what that accent was. Punts it long. Get in, Steve Cook. So I got some comments. Y'all said you would keep Steve Cook, you know, to keep some uh, age in the squad. Oh, Zavi Simons on the volley, like off the bounce, hits the woodwork. It's gotten spicy out there, my friends. Hopefully that's... Oh, I was thinking that looked like a, a red card trot up. He's just run right past Steve Cook, hasn't he? Podluck, pause it over. Okay, get in, son. I just realized I don't have the sound on. I don't have my earbuds in. So for those of you that are enjoying sound in games... Okay. Win that? Wait, he didn't. He didn't win that. He's offside. Get in. I can't believe Marson scored that early, right? Like, he's really more of a target forward. I've got him playing target forward, but uh, that looked like pressing forward to me. He, he's taken the tactic to heart. He's taken the tactic to heart. That's uh, offside by a half mile. Like, 
Come on, city son, eh? Come on, mate. I'm gonna demand more here at the end of the end of the first half. Weird camera angle adjustment. You know that happens though. That happens in real life. Sometimes it's like that's offside. That's it's off. He's offside, lads. I thought he was offside. The TV director's like, camera nine, and camera nine's like busy like cleaning the lenses, like, oh hey, you know. What's the upside? Mmm. And that's Bolison again. I I think that might have been off. Bolison has having a mare of a game. 6.3. What are we doing, lads? I'm gonna I'm gonna say, what was that? Yeah. I'm gonna send them back out there. We'd like to get the draw just to get some some uh, revenue going here. Bolison has jumped up to a 6.6 .6 in the first 10 minutes of the first half from a 6.3. How does that happen? Ludogorets is beating Club Bruges. It's almost like the teams that have qualified have rotated. Mm, maybe. He jets right past him. Bolison's there, though. Okay, we're gonna take it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, good save! And Joe Scally's there to clean up the mess at the back on a 6.4. Ooh. Come on, lads. Okay. Okay, chips it in. Sané. Chips it back. Oh, if that was going to be Sané to land for, for a goal, I may have squealed. I may have squealed a little bit, my friends. Um, I guess last 20 minutes we could see who I put on the bench. I know Joe Gelhart's there. So, yeah. Let's, uh, let's see if we can rescue this. Bring it on Joe Gelhart. Um... Yeah, um, Eric's having a better game than Nikolai, which is not what you want to see, to be completely honest with you. Um, we could bring Metza in on the left wing. He can play left wing. And then I do trust, I don't know why I trust in Nikolai a little bit more, but we'll bring on Thomas. And we're going to say, go for it, lads. You know, you got 70 of 90 minutes rested. That makes sense to me. Demand more, lads. In the last 10 minutes, we might as well go very attacking if, it's, if it doesn't start working here. Okay, nice job, Thomas. Winning that back. Because the idea, obviously, is if you lose, then it's like dynamics, right? Like, that's not good. But I, I, thought, I thought we had just enough quality to, to nick it here um, while still resting. So we'll see if we can get something here in the last 20 minutes. Taking the youngster off on the back line. Bringing on Thomas, natural left wing back. Metz is definitely not a natural left winger, but I guess we could put Marvin out there and put Metz in the advanced playmaker. That's his, his favorite role, but he chests that down. He said, I can do a job. He picks out a pass, pulls it back. We reset. Nassim. Okay, Thomas overlapping. Ball in. Oh, target forward, man. He was there. But he's 17, and that's bound to happen. <sighs> Luca said, no one wants to defend that, eh? Lots? Anyone? Come on, boys. They've given up 15 goals now. Let's make it 16. Oh, that was good, except Zavi was too slow on the draw there. Romero. Thomas has already picked up a yellow. Gets in. Metza, first time, brings it down. Finishes. Joe Gelhart. Get in. Do we... Mm, no, I think very attacking is going to result in a goal. But we'll leave it on attacking. We'll leave it on attacking. Gets the equalizer. Thomas wins it back. Joe, first time. Look at that. Metza brings it down. That was lovely. That was lovely. I'm going to... Oh, who's going to demand more? They've made two subs. Is that... Did that stay in? Oh, if he doesn't cover that, that's a tap-in for Marson there at the back post. Hmm... Okay. Okay. Dropping deep there, target forward man with the purple boots on. Pings it forward. Maximiliano. Oh, plays it to the young man, Mercy! Third goal of the season. I'm a proud papa. He gets a brace in the Europa League. The 17-year-old announces himself on the international, not international, but the continental stage. Look at that, my friends. Are you serious? Did that just, oh no. Come on, come on.
Come on, let, let the young man have the winner. You guys haven't, you're not going to qualify anyway, okay? It's fine. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, ball in. <sighs> I'm, I'm leaving it. This, this is our tactic and formation. Maybe if, like, the, this highlight doesn't result in a goal, we'll try, like, control and, like, slowing the pace down and wasting all the time. Uh-oh. That was lovely. He's in. Oh, what a save by Luca! Oh, I can't save the second one, though. Of course. Back to very attacking, lads. That was a good save. Luca's on a 6.6 .6 here. Surely it goes up. That first save was good stuff. Back pedals, back pedals. He's there. Good... Oh, he needed more help from his defenders there. Both of them chase Rodriguez. It goes in. Oh, he still gets a 6.6. .6. I think that's harsh. We'll take the draw. I'm not upset. A win would have been nice. We still get a little bit of money. Um, good work to salvage something in the second half. Let's not be upset. Ooh, didn't realize this. We skip the first knockout run and go straight to the second knockout run. That means we get paid for that, right? Right. First knockout round, you get 500 grand for appearing. Second knockout round, you get 1.2 million for appearing. That's absolutely massive. And we got 120 or 210 grand for instead of 630. So that hurts a little bit. But again, I mean, if you look at the run of games, right? We have a game in three days and a game in six days and then a game in five days, right? Like this is an important game against fifth place. So resting those players, I think it's worth it to get a draw. Plus we got to see freaking Marson. Get in, son. Legend status incoming. All right, folks. This is what the table looks like as we get ready to take on Wolfsburg. All right. So um, we find ourselves currently in 12th. Uh, obviously, the game in hand, if we win, could jump us up to 10th. Um, yeah. And I've also promised David uh, Hanko that we wouldn't use him until December 5th. He was, uh, he was in quite dire need of a rest and so he's got it let's go take on Wolfsburg yeah also want to point out so we got Scally Malik Steve Cook Thomas on the back line Bolison can come in as our first sub for either left back or center back uh Zavi Simons has continued to like improve over and over and obviously we've played him a ton he really does need a rest like after this game if we can afford to to get him out uh, Zalazar has had blisters. He's back for five days and in five days it said he could go, but I'm like, mm, let's run Zavi out one more time and hope he doesn't get hurt. Victor comes back in as the bowling midfielder, Joe Gelhart, Metza, Ali, and Xerxy up top. But look at our bench. It's almost like a, like a, a boxing day pandemic bench that you're currently seeing in the premier league. So we've got Karim, our, you know, youth prospect on the left, uh, left center back. We got Mehmet Chan Aydin that can cover the right back. We got Bozdegan as our, uh, he could play anywhere in these three spots here, I guess. Um, Metin Yilmaz um, is a ball-winning midfielder, you know, central def uh, central midfielder on defend type player. 17 years old. Yep. Homegrown prospect. Nassim. Is Nassim ours? Yes. I knew that. Yes, of course. Marvin and Marson. Marvin and Marson. There, there's an episode title for you. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. We don't get to see the form. I don't like that in this in this Bundesliga official thing. Obviously, Wolfsburg is significantly better than us, which should surprise no one, but we're sticking with the attacking Gagan pressing, and we'll see how bad we get ripped up here. But maybe we start developing that tactical familiarity, and everyone knows where this is be on the pitch, and it works out. Both left backs have, uh, have yellows. That's kind of interesting. Okay, ball down. Malik intercepts that. Oh, it was a little nervy on the passing there, but it, it works out. Malik is obviously not a ball-playing defender. Joe Gelhart sent it into the sixth row, but, you know, you know, just he's trying to intimidate the keeper there. Castiles, I can, I can kick it really hard in your direction, not at your face, but in your direction. Malik gets it back. Metza, there you go. Joe, okay, Scally thought he was going to do the little overlap, pick that up, but he doesn't. It's cut back. Hmm. Nicely done to intercept that, but we win it back. Yes. Metza. Gelhart. He goes again. Oh, he's hit the... Was that the post or the bar? That that had some curve on it. Oh, I thought that was in. I thought that was in. We've at, le at least, you know, in the first 20 minutes, we've had the same number of shots. Well, they just got an extra shot. Same number of shots on target. You know, we've held our own. We've held our own. Let's go, lads. Encourage. Little smiles on the faces. There you go. 
Steve Cook is like, I'm an old man. You're playing me in back-to-back -back games three days apart. I'm old. I, I need to come off. <laughs> Ali is like, I just have poor physical fitness because Ali was just rested. He, he wasn't on the bench for last game. He just doesn't have the, the natural fitness. And we've had a mix-up as to who's covering the man with the ball. Just casually let him run down. Easy. It's fine. Just nothing to worry about. Just let him go. It's fine. Simons is on to 6.4. He's starting to get exhausted. Ooh, dear. Um, keep going. Yes, please. Lads. Um, keep going. Everyone, just keep... You've bossed the midfield. You don't agree. You don't agree, apparently. Um, so I've demotivated the player with the highest rating in the first half. Great. It's, it's, you know, tactical masterclass here. We've had more shots, and we've had more on target, and we had, we've had more possession. I don't think I'm wrong. Almoez. All right, son. Away. Nice job, Malik. Okay. Zerk Z wins that. He needs runners. He's got runners, and he's going to just do a 360 and hand it off the ball-winning midfielder. Who is not the passing maestro here. Malik is not either. There's Steve Cook. There you go. Ball playing defender. Can he pick out a pass with his eight vision? Mm, eight vision. Joe Scally. Okay. Joe Gelhart. Joe Gelhart breaks it down. Doinkage. Everybody. Oh, it's really this, isn't it? Give me a like for the doinkage. A like for the doinkage. A counter-attacking doinkage, my friends. What's not to love? At home, Joe Scally. Victor, who I just said is not the passing maestro, plays it into space for Joe Gelhart to doink over the keeper. Can we hold on? Okay. I'm looking at I'm looking at exhaustion here. I think Xavi's gotta be first here, but we wanna see how long yeah. Ball, box to box midfielder starting to get knackered. Ooh, gosh. Um mm, I think it's Nassim. Nassim, come on down, son. And I think we're going to freshen off the back of line and bring on Nikolai because Steve Cook is playing all right, but he's in poor physical condition. Garage door. I think I've, I've changed my mic settings to where you don't get to hear as much garage door these days. It's like, you know, it's almost like I'm, I'm trying to improve the audio quality of my production here. <laughs> what am I doing that for? Um, we have one more sub. We'll think about it in a minute. Al Almoez is, is exhausted. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Plays it forward. Xerxy just kind of lets it fall. Not loving that. We almost won that back. But we didn't. Nikolai, though, fresh legs. Wins the header, but Almoez has not the fresh legs and lets them have it back. Malik steps forward. That was good anticipation. Xerxy, touch. Mm, he was getting closed down on the angle, but they don't see Nassim! Nassim with the first goal of the series. Oh my god. It's time to make the sub. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, I think we bring on Karim. We let Karim play a little inside forward, even though he's a winger. We've got a two goal lead against Wolfsburg. Apparently, comment section, you deserve the like because you're like, stop changing tactics. Stop it. Stop it. And uh it's it's worked. At least this time. You know, I feel like, you know, you go to you go to like you know, you restart FM and you get a different version every time. It's like this is the version where you're losing a lot, you know? Um we're gonna give a little praise here to kinda we'll fill up the tanks here at the end. Oh, I thought we were going for a red card. We have not. We play it back. Just just see the game out, lads. There's come on, there's two minutes left. John Brooks, American international-ish, if his legs can stop being injured, or his back, or all the all the body parts. That was a lovely cross, but there's no way that was going to go anywhere. Like, he's behind the penalty spot there. If he makes that, that'd be unreal. And he would deserve the goal. Joe Scally, Victor, doink. Okay. All right, lads, we don't... Oh, come on, come on. There's a minute left. Come on, come on. Oh, are we going to get a, a, a second yellow here? Don't Don't pick it up. They had the runner. He overran it, though. Joe, Go Joe Gelhart is inside forwarding it all the way to the left wing. And now he's hurt. 
And now, he, of course, he's of 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 course he's hurt. Here, we'll do this. It's just something control. Fine, less less intense. It's there's thirty seconds left. Oh, Joe. I was wondering why it was showing us that highlight and we get an injured Joe. Um, that was an excellent one. I think we could say something other than it was a nice one. Well, it's like nice and calm, like as if it was expected, you know, like, come on, lads. Um, we did get it over the line. We were great. Those seem like different answers. As noted, that jumps us to 10th. Get in! We are now 7 points clear of the relegation playoffs and 9 points clear of the relegation zone. We're only 5 points off where we were last year. Or I guess, technically, we took the 7th place spot because of the DFB Pokal. But get in. Oh, 4 to 7 weeks. The last minute of the game, he gets a 4 to 7 week injury. Mate, you're going you're gonna to play when you come back because we have no one else. He's a little jaded and can do with a rest. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to go deal with all that. We're unbeaten in the last five. I don't think I really need to show you the Europa League. It's a, we've won the group. Not, none of that's going to change, so we're going to skip that. I'm actually going to hop us forward to probably... Ooh, do I have time to do this? Probably the end of the January transfer window. Ooh. And then after that, it'll be the DFB... Or it could be the DFB Pokal third round if like we don't do anything in the transfer window so i guess i should ask you what 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 would you would you spend any money i'm pretty happy with the squad and i'm a little hesitant to shake things up we got five million in the bank to spend plus you know <laughs> an absurd amount of of uh wage budget so like i'm not saying we couldn't but we could go out and get somebody what would you do if you enjoyed that episode my friends you know what to do hit that like button thanks for your support means a lot I'll see you next time. Get out! <laughs>